So, let's talk training this week. Specifically, let's talk about a down week. This is a concept that I've come to enjoy and also admittingly have a very tough time with psychologically. And uh, so I'm here out in uh, Peace Park here in Austin, Texas, uh, the peripheral edges, just doing a, a post ride walk to just see the world get outside and have some fun doing it. If you're anything like me, you got your, your sights set on a goal that's so far in the future. And in my case, this would be Ironman, Texas in April of 2024. We're not even in the training block of the periodization of like the actual training that's going to get race pace ready. Right now I'm in a preseason play just working on zone two aerobic form function just understanding the body. It's been a fascinating time. I've never taken six months just to kind of work out the kinks and get myself going. Even though we set big goals we can we can't forget about the other end of the spectrum. We can't forget about our psychological needs and the weekend needs. It doesn't mean we're weak and it doesn't mean we're taking our foot off the gas. Sometimes you got to, got to let the engine recoup, come out to a beautiful park, enjoy the Saturday, get in touch with the community, understand the beauty of where we live, the sense of place, the sense of time, and just ride the beautiful wave. I'm going to finish my walk here in Peace Park. It's not Peace, P-E-A-C-E, -E, it's P-E-A-S-E. -E. It's a beautiful park. Another cool thing is the sounds of the dog collars and the sprinkler systems and the crickets and the small voices in the background it's just so beautiful so thanks for following this week let me know if you take a down week let me know if it's well received if you have a hard time with down weeks sometimes psychologically speaking what do you do on your down week? Do you keep the intensity high and lower the volume? Do you lower the intensity and keep the volume? Do you lower everything and go eat a nice pizza out somewhere? Enjoy a morning coffee and a few pastries, a few dozen, maybe even a cupcake on a Saturday morning. I don't know, I like doing that stuff. In my case, it's about opening up my perception of the world around me observing what other people are doing, feeding off of that energy, fueling my nervous system, coming out here and just moving, moving around and enjoying what the city has to offer. I hope you're enjoying your cities. I hope you're enjoying your weekends. I hope you're enjoying your long runs and your training routines. Thanks for joining. See y'all next week. Of course we have to enjoy it now because next week when we turn the volume back up if we didn't take the down week we're gonna wish we had funny how that works